So on my channel, I like to do a lot of automotive related things. I kind of think this is sort of in that genre or that realm. Uh, I'm a big wearer of flannel. I love flannels when I'm working on the cars, out in the garage, something that's a little bit heavier, uh, you know, as the as fall and winter set in, they're just so comfortable and so great. And I'll tell you, I'm normally a Duluth purchaser. I've had great luck with Duluth Trading Company. No quarrel with the products, but I've been seeing advertising for uh, Dixon flannel. So I took a shot. I ordered this shirt. I want to offer a quick review, having literally just, uh, just received this. So first thing, I mean, super cool. Uh, kudos to them for the marketing. So this particular color, this is the Dixon Bondo Bucket. I uh, got the truck, truck logo on it, which is pretty neat. Uh, it came with this tag hanging on as well, if you can see that. Um, you know, it certainly appeals to the car guy in me. But, uh, you know, obviously, be that as it may, when you wear it, you don't care what the tag looks like. So, uh, you know, I got this. And again, as a comparison to, say, uh, Duluth, pricing at normal price seems to be similar between the two. Uh, the Duluths tend to feel softer to me. Now, this is brand new, to be fair. Uh, this compares to the lighter of the two uh, Duluths that are offered. But something I think is really, really cool about these is the snap closures. I don't know how well you can see that, but these snaps, uh, I love, you know, when you're working on things in the garage, it's so easy to get a button caught. And by the virtue of the snaps and the way they're designed... Uh, you know, I, I see me much less likely to grab those on something when I'm under a car or a truck. Here you see the Dixon logo, really slick. Again, snap closure here. Uh, I tried the shirt on. They say they run large. Uh, my experience with this in diameter, if you're heavier, uh, you know, in diameter, I think the shirt's right on the button. Probably uh, in the upper chest, it's a little fuller. So for somebody that's really muscular, I think that'd be a great fit. This particular size is a is a 2X. That's what I wear. I don't know if it shows it on there somewhere or not, but it's probably on there and I don't see it. But but uh, you know, just as a as an overall, just an immediate, the pattern looks great. The quality feels very, very good. Only place we have the buttons, nice detail uh, down here on the sleeves. But other than that, you've got the snaps. Uh, it's a nice shirt. I'd call this a medium weight as opposed to a heavy. Uh, you can actually see, funny enough, in the video here, this is a Dixon. Uh, excuse me. This is a uh, Duluth that I'm wearing currently, So, which I also think very highly of. But, you know, I thought uh, somebody considering the purchase of a Dixon, these are not inexpensive shirts, uh, might appreciate just getting kind of a, you know, right out of the package. It came packaged very, very nicely. Uh, probably one of the more impressive packaging jobs. It was in a in a plastic wrap that was totally sealed. Uh, another nice thing, it came a lot like a dress shirt. It had clips uh, at the shoulders. It, it was pinned closed. So it's folded a lot like a dress shirt. And it even came with the uh, cardboard insert that kept the collar square. So a nice thing right out of the packaging. I'm not going to. I'll launder it first. But, you know, for somebody that orders one of these and wants to wear it, I mean, it comes out in pretty nice shape. So, again, this pattern is the Bondo Bucket. This is a 2X, uh, you know, initial wear. Very, very nice. Uh, now, the laundering instructions, you can find this, I'm sure, on their website, but I did note that they uh, they want you to, the tumble drying is very, very low or just hang it to dry. So I'll be interested to see how the colors last and how it wears, as I no doubt will wear it quite a lot. Um, but I'm not afraid of that. And being warned up front, I'll make sure to be cautious with it. So Anyway, quick review of the uh, Dixon flannel. Again, this one's the Bondo Bucket, a 2X. Uh, keep an eye on the channel. I'll have a follow-up on this in a few months after I've worn it a bunch and laundered it. Uh, but so far, very, very impressed. I am not at all sorry that I invested in one. I think I'm really going to love this through the winter. If you have any questions or comments, please put them down below. I'll uh, get right back to you and uh, keep on trucking. Have a great day. And as always, don't forget, please like and subscribe. It's critical for us to build the channel. We're going to have a lot more reviews on the old trucks that we have on the property, uh, more clothing reviews, our electric bikes, uh, many, many other things coming. So tune in soon. I'm sure there'll be more that uh, will hold your interest. Thank you so much. Have a great day.